hello guys how are you so in this tutor tutorial you will see how to install and configure next cloud on ubuntu 16.04 vps and dedicated server okay so first check out what is next cloud next cloud is an open source and self-hosted file sharing application which is forked from on cloud and now we will see how to install this before installing next cloud you should have following setup on your server first you should do some initial set set setup on your server then you should install the lamp stack on your ubuntu 604 box and the next is optional it is not compulsory you should install ssl certificate for secure connection if you don't want secure connection then you can leave this step okay so now move on how to install next cloud on ubuntu 604 vps okay so let's start this first we will visit the official uh, we will visit the official press release page uh, official release page of next cloud okay and from there we will get the latest version and latest version of next cloud so just visit the official web page next cloud and here it is we will use this next cloud 10.0.1 tar.bz so just copy the url copy link address and paste it in a clipboard okay now go back we will download this also one more file will be needed which is tar uh, next cloud and point zero point one tar dot bz dot sha256 so this will also be required in the installation process so this file and this file just copy the link of this file and then we can go ahead installation of next cloud okay now just go to your temp directory using cd temp command okay now we are under temp directory now just we will download the latest latest version of next cloud okay so we'll use curl command to download this okay this file is of 33 mb and it will download within a second okay now we will need the second file that is dot sha version here you can check this is dot sha version we will download this on our server okay that has been also downloaded now we will run shasham command sha sem shasham command will calculate the hash for the dot tar dot bz2 file and compare it to the checksum value in the sha256 file okay so copy this command we have to copy this command and run this in our terminal so this will give this output next cloud at 10.0.1 dot tar dot bz is okay okay now moving ahead now we can remove the sha file this will not be required for the installation so we'll remove this okay now moving ahead how to install next cloud okay before installing we have to extract the tarbell file so we'll extract it right now this will take few seconds in the extraction of file okay so just wait okay it has been done now moving ahead we have to create a shell file in the temp directory and file name will be next cloud.sh you can just create this file using nano editor okay 
now add some code in this file so this is the code just copy this code and paste in your nano editor now save and exit nano editor moving ahead we have created the file now we will run this file using bash command okay so just run this command bash ls temp slash nextcloud.sh okay now we'll running this command and we'll show this output okay if there will be any error in this output like uh, invalid uh, username or invalid file then just check out if there is any error in the this file or if have if there is any error in copying the code okay now moving ahead so now there is no error and we can move ahead for the installation process now we need to create next cloud site configuration in slash etc slash apache 2 slash site available directory using nano editor so just copy this command line and run in your terminal now we need to paste in these lines in our file okay. just copy it and paste in this file now save and exit saved now now we have to enable the site using n2 site command and also use n2 and mode command to enable rewrite okay so just run this command to enable the next cloud site okay so this has been enabled now now moving ahead we have to install some PHP modules which will be required to run uh, next cloud properly okay so just run this command first update the Linux version that is Ubuntu version and then run this command to install the module okay this will take few seconds just wait for this to be done then we will move ahead this will take few seconds only okay so this has been done now we can move ahead now we have we have to create a mysql database so first, first we have to log into mysql as root and this will be required a root password you must be having your mysql root password so just log into your mysql root okay now we need to create a database okay so just create a database with a database name you can use any database name of your choice i'm using next cloud db okay so just run this line to create a database query one affected database has been created now now we have to grant permission to the database okay and uh, you can use any username you have to, you have to create a user and you have also create a password okay and this password will be required for the in the installation also this username will be required okay so i'm using username this same as in the database name and i will set a password okay so just run this command my database name is same as the username and now I will set a password so okay so permission has been granted username and password has been created now flush the previous 
plus run run the plus privilege operation now exit okay so database part has been done now now what we have to do we have to go to our server uh, web browser and type https slash server ip slash next cloud use https if you are using secure connection that is you have ssl enabled on your server if you don't have ssl then just run http colon slash slash server ip that is what you use your server ip and then next cloud so i am not using http s because i don't have http I don't have SSL, okay, so I'm not using HTTP. Why? So we were getting error because we have not restarted the Apache. Just restart the Apache. Then it will work fine. Okay. Asking for the password. Password authenticated. Now go back to your browser and open Next Cloud. Okay. So Next Cloud has been open. Now you can create admin username okay so here you can put your username here you can put your admin password which is required to log into your next cloud okay so just put any i'm using admin and password okay so you just create a safe and secure username and password for demo purpose I'm using this one and not data folder don't alter this data folder just leave it as it is now here fill the database user and database password so what user and password we used just check here Okay, so database name was this which we used username database name is same database password I said this one okay now click on finish the installation this will take few seconds and installation will be done just wait for it so once the installation will be done we will be redirected inside the admin panel of next cloud okay just close this button now you can upload any your file here so this is all about how to install and configure next cloud on ubuntu 16.04 vps